Well boys, the new War Thunder update's out, and it added something that I was not expecting at all. If you don't know what this is, don't worry, I didn't either until like two days ago. This is the Japanese Type 99 SPH. It's got a pretty fast reload rate for a howitzer. Everything else is, well, what you would expect. So yeah, let's take it out and have some fun smacking people with giant high explosive shells. Alright, I am formulating a plan. A devious plan. Our muzzle velocity is really, really good. So I'm just gonna sit back and snipe, I think. If I can find some flat ground over here. Obviously, our gun depression is terrible. <laughs> oh, I just saw another man. Uh... Oh! Yep, that works. <laughs> Had to do some real quick math, which... That's probably my worst subject. Ooh! <laughs> uh, I already love this thing. I'm not quite sure where to aim to hit him. Okay, that was a tree. Uh, nope, that was another tree. It might have been the same tree, actually, now that I think about it. Why am I incapable of hitting this guy now? Oh, he's behind a rock. I am not incredibly bright. That was another rock. Ow. Yep, it's time to go. Bye-bye. Oh. Okay, let's see if we can cycle back around. Shoot the thing that shot us. Uh, are you good, man? Do you need some assistance? Okay, he's not actually on fire. The game lied to me. Uh... I'm debating... Never mind. Ooh, target spotted. I do believe that's 650. I hit the same corpse again. There we go. My aim was great for about two minutes in the start of the match, and then it just got progressively worse. I think I'm just gonna rush. I am getting a little bored just sitting back here. My goblin playstyle is starting to shine through. How did I miss that? One of the biggest ground vehicles in the entire game. I just completely missed it. Howitzers are probably my new favorite type of vehicle in this game. Because, like, they kill things in one shot usually, but they're not easy to aim most of the time. I feel like they're a little bit more challenging than most vehicles, if that makes sense. But their payoff is great because it's just so much fun. Smacking people with a giant high explosive round. How did that R3 trade with that F8? The R3 is probably one of the easiest anti-airs to use. Yep. If we can get gun depression, which we cannot because we are fat and slow and stupid. There we go. <laughs> Having no gun depression has nothing to do with being fat and slow. It doesn't help, but like, those are two entirely different issues. Ace in the first match, that's pretty good, I think. I don't know. My bar for good performance in this game is entirely out of whack. No, no, don't you dare. Don't you dare. How is that still a thing? Where you research a new round and it's like, okay, you're gonna get a full ammo load now. There's no way that's 18 rounds. <laughs> I may not be very good at math, but it ain't adding up. It's really funny, this is literally just big Type 75. Yeah, probably not a great idea to cross in front of that. Ooh, that was a tiger. Ow. I just remembered that this map is terrible for HE vehicles because the bamboo shoots have tree-sized hitboxes. Just typical War Thunder quality control, you know. Oh, um... Yeah, I don't think we can really do anything to that. Uh, we can do something to that, though. <laughs> yeah, bye. Hope you have roof insurance. The war is not going well. Not going well at all. Wait, there's a TV behind us. I might just go deal with that, honestly. This area is too hot for me. Oh, I think you died. We were getting flanked by a Yag Tiger. The map is Japan, yet my Japanese tank is not doing so hot. Curious. Please repair. Okay. That's not what I meant to hit, but I think they'll get the message. Oh my god, what? <laughs> what on earth? <laughs> How? 
I... <laughs> I don't even have words, man. I can't... I don't know if that should have happened. Honestly, that's just karma for trying to shoot me, I think. Why, dude? You know, this is a lot like the ALF-1, except our turret traverse is actually decent. Okay, well... If I... <laughs> yeah, if I had taken an extra second to aim that, we probably could have killed him. Oh. I forgot I didn't have APHG. That's suboptimal. How foolish of me to think that shooting an IS-3 in its weakest point would destroy it. Get out of here, dude. <laughs> Trying to be cheeky. Ooh, light tank over here. Can I see him, actually? I can. Oh, buddy. <laughs> I got you, T29. You're not dying on my watch, I hope. It'd be really unfortunate if he exploded right after I said that for no reason. I think we can safely conclude that this map layout is just an absolute mess. <laughs> <laughs> Sit down, man. We absolutely cleaned his clock. I think I'm just going to continue using various outdated white catchphrases whenever I do something exciting in these videos. That's my brand. I'm very white, I might as well lean into it, you know? Yeah, teamwork. Meaning that I just existed while he bombed someone from orbit. <laughs> yeah, I think he's dead. <laughs> um. Don't do that, please. How did he not kill us? That is honestly impressive. <laughs> like, one of the scariest vehicles at this BR. Oh, I'm probably dead from that. Surprisingly not. Anyway, as I was saying, like... One of the deadliest vehicles at this BR, it just fails to kill this, which is armor-wise, coughing baby. That sentence probably sounds unhinged to someone that isn't like 20 years old. I don't know what is making that noise, but I hate it. It's like this crinkling noise. I don't know why Gaijin thought it'd be a good idea, because it just sounds like static in my headphones. I hate it. I hate it a lot. God, I'm so hungry right now. I don't know what to get though. I ordered from this Mexican place a few days ago, but they forgot like half of my order. <laughs> so, probably not gonna do that again. I think probably pizza would be good. Ooh, I hear a Hellcat. <laughs> I would be so mad, dude. <laughs> he got absolutely destroyed oh my goodness hi no don't do that don't do that i don't like that very sad that it hit his barrel yep goodbye i didn't intentionally use that 2s3m as bait uh yep that'll do it well i probably could hit that guy anywhere and it would have killed him i thought it was a jumbo but nope Oh god. <laughs> that... <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't laugh. Maybe his internet's just really bad. <laughs> his, his reaction time. Not great. Um... Yeah, don't even need to hit him. Just... <laughs> Spike it off the wall. Hey, maybe if that T-25 had a stabilizer, he could have shot first, huh? This poor panther is getting shot by another duster. <laughs> he cannot catch a break. See ya. Another T25, man. I I feel so bad for T25 players. It's just such a depressing vehicle to play. And to kill, because like, most of the time they don't even fight back. I think that's a Centurion? No, that is a T29, I think. Nope, oh, T34. There we go, yep, T34. I can only really tell because of the muzzle brake. Otherwise, they look practically identical to me. 
really quite happy that we managed to turn this one around. It was not looking so hot in the start. I think this is supposed to have a laser rangefinder. Obviously it doesn't have one in the game, otherwise I wouldn't be missing a single shot. I'm kinda glad that it doesn't have one though, we don't need another Vidar. Yes, I pronounced it somewhat correctly this time, you can stop bugging me about it. Enemy's capping B. Hold up. Hold up. <laughs> Couldn't see him for a second. Oh, another duster. It's the same panther! No, no, not again. Don't, don't do that. I think the plan here is to do a little bit of this. Maybe a little bit less running into the building. Now I can go forward if there's a bad guy. Unless I forget which way I'm facing. Later. Alright, it looks like no one went this way anyway, so I guess we'll push. There's a jumbo pershing around here, and that scares me quite a lot because it's pretty resistant to overpressure. Oh, thank you, Hitbox. I really appreciate that. <laughs> Thankfully, it looks like no one noticed. Somehow. Uh... Okay. Alright. Note to self. Pershing Capola, invincible. There we go. There we go, dude. Took out two Jumbo Pershings. It's pretty cool if you ask me. Um... Yep, another one. Make it three. Doing my team a massive favor because the T26 E5 is just insanely good. I mean, you guys know. You saw how they steamrolled my team over here. Um. Ooh. <laughs> I mean, these are really easy to aim because they're insanely high velocity, but still, I'm hitting some pretty nice shots. I'm really not sure what to do now. Oh, that's a lot of planes. Uh, that's gonna be a bit tricky. Never mind, apparently it'd be really easy. Yeah man, I gotta say, I'm loving this thing. It's like Vidar, but not obscenely busted. Ow. Oh, cool. Very cool. I'm really glad this guy is just hyper-focused on me, for some reason. Oh uh, yeah, thanks for reminding me that we need more map bands, Gaijin. This is probably gonna get me killed, but my head hurts, so... I'm just rushing. <laughs> yep. Uh, I don't even know where to shoot that. <laughs> that works. <laughs> Ooh, I couldn't even see that one! Well, obviously I did for a split second, but you know. Ow. Oh, our reverse speed is pretty good, actually. Oh, I don't... What the hell is doing that? What? <laughs> okay. I don't know what happened to my first round, but... What was shooting me? Oh, I think he he wasted all of his ammo in one go. <laughs> yeah, don't don't do that if you're in the Antos. Oh my God, that's so loud. <laughs> uh, I don't know how he killed the T34. Hang on, just a little bit longer, Abel. Oh, what? <laughs> uh, okay, there we go. I am perplexed and confused. I hate playing this side of the map because you can pretty much only play this side. If you try to go to the other caps, you just get shot. So yeah, that's the Type 99 SPH. I think it's a ton of fun personally. Obviously, the gun depression limits you quite a lot. The turret reverse is pretty good though. The reload's really good. The mobility is okay. Its reverse speed's pretty high, which I think helps it out a lot. 
Anyway, if you guys have suggestions for video topics, leave them in the comments. And I'll see you on the next one.